today is Halloween. Oh, yeah, happy Halloween. Yeah, happy Halloween. And, uh, yesterday we were watching all the kids go by down the street, like to school and stuff on Friday in their Halloween costumes. So, we've chosen how we're going to celebrate Halloween is by leaving and going home. <laughs> We're walking down to the uh, little French pastry shop to meet Shane and Jen for uh, a last breakfast. And we're uh, pretty much taking our last walk through New York again. So we uh, have to go back to the room and finish packing and then uh, get a shuttle to the airport. That was a good breakfast. We just had to say goodbye to Shane and Jen and Sienna. So now I go back to the apartment, and pack, and head home. You gonna miss Sienna? Very much. Yeah. Too bad we didn't stay for Halloween this year, go trick or treating. I guess that was poor planning on our part. But yeah, oh well. On Halloween. Oh well. <laughs> What is that crazy lady doing all the way over there? <laughs> what, you going home without us? Hey, joke's on you, I got the key. And there's a book over there. Yeah, is that staying? Alright, we are all ready to leave. Super shuttle's down. Super shuttle is downstairs waiting for us. Thank you. Megan grabbed it. You guys go. Do you see him? Outside waiting my ass. Oh, I think he's down here. Is that super shuttle? Bless you. You want me to put that on? Yeah, if you can, thank you. No problem. So we made it through security, and now we're just kind of aimlessly wandering around the airport, trying to find something to entertain us for like two and a half hours. And I'm sure we'll probably just end up hitting the bar, because that's what we always do. Is this the lounge, or is that the restaurant? I lost her. I lost you. What are you doing? You want these snacks? Or at least look? Oh, snacks? Yeah, I don't know what I want. I think at this point, I've, we've got a pastrami sandwich and pizza, so I'm good on the flight. I know I can eat that stuff, even if you don't want to. 
Otherwise, I'd rather do a salad or a fruit, to be honest. And you know what? I think they sell that stuff even on the plane. Um, there's, you can get a fresh salad with whatever you want. I'm sure to go over there. And they also have bananas and oranges and there's hummus and, and you're, like. You're feeling like I am too. Like after I'm ready, I'm ready to detox. We've been eating, we've been eating pretty gross. Not gross, but like really awesome rich food for like the past week and a half. And like I'm ready to detox and go back to fresh fruits and vegetables. Like if they had a big bundle of grapes, that would be awesome. But so far, all I'm seeing are apples and oranges and bananas. How's it going, sir? Good, how are you? Good. So that part really uh, touched you, huh? It did. Makes it a lot more real. When you're just hearing the numbers, over 3,000 people died, you know, and yada yada. But when you actually go there and see all their faces, that really makes it real. To me, right. to me anyway, really, it made it real to me. And to it's see like, all of that, those faces, it, it made it more like the magnitude of it too. Yeah, so many of them. It just... So we're going with a healthier option if we can. Even though we just drank a bottle of wine. Wine isn't that bad for you. <laughs> it's better than beer. <laughs> what are you saying about me? You're, you're talking shit about beer. How are you talking shit about beer? Beer is my friend. Beer is your friend. Beer's beer is my e friend too. Beer is everybody's friend. It's not my belly's friend. <laughs> It's good for my belly. Thank you. Oh yeah, you don't have a second. Nope. So I can put this down at my feet. That's perfect. So I went and got Megan and I a couple of cranberry juices. I'm gonna see if on the flight if we can't get a couple vodkas, like mix them into the cranberry juices and hopefully that'll knock us out for like the duration of the flight. Otherwise, we're just gonna be drinking like plain cranberry juice, which is kind of gross. Somebody's, somebody's come between us. And we don't even know who. Can you grab any other food? Oh yeah, you did. Yeah. So, did they call oh, they people they up had, there yet? They had a leftover oh, yeah. pizza and leftover... The on board flight crew just got here. So why are people lining up? They're just getting in the way. Yes, that's right. That was really weird. They're having everybody walk down the stairs. So like people who didn't have their bags right by them, we had to like swim upstream to get our bags. And then we exited out of the back of the plane. That was, that was really weird. That was very weird. Totally. Whatever. That was the first for me. Now how long of a layover do we have? Now it's only like two hours, right? <laughs> So I guess I can't complain too much about exiting out of the back of the plane because we didn't get charged for our drinks, so. Long Beach, California. We're stuck in Long Beach for like two hours, something like that. We gotta find something to do. Let's go find a bar. Sure. Wonder where a bar is at. Snacks and gifts with an arrow. I bet it's that way. 
Okay, there was a mall, uh, wall that way, so that wasn't the way, so maybe the opposite way, maybe that way is the right way. So we found this little spot. There's like, what, four places here in this whole terminal? It's like this tiny little terminal. But we found this little spot with like outdoor seating. Let's see if we can get a beer or something like that. See, this is where we have confusion. If you come out of the gate, you would think that this is our plane, because it's right there. No. That's our plane over there. So we have to make sure that we exit the gate and get on the right plane. I don't that's, know where we're That's going. supposed to say Sacramento right there. <laughs> Did you trip? Are you okay? No. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay though? I'm sorry. I didn't think anyone saw either. What did you do? <laughs> did you really fall? Not too bad. I just kind of... Up the steps? <laughs> I think I stepped on my jacket as I was coming up and it made me trip. And then the flight the beer might have played a factor. <laughs> Maybe. I'm thinking. Do not accept packages. So we finally landed in Sacramento, but now we have like another hour before we can get home. Apparently my backpack straps like smacked a bunch of people on the way down the plane, so probably pissed off all the first class people. Oh well. <laughs> 